So what got me into painting, um, I suppose really I didn't have to get into painting, it's just something I've always done my whole life really. Um, my parents have always said about me, which I think people have said about a lot of artists really, is that from the moment I could pick up anything from a pen or a pencil, or just anything to make a mark with, that's what I was doing. In terms of how it's become a vocation, why is it something that I kind of persist in doing and have to do all the time? I think um, for me it kind of links into um, a bigger picture of my worldview, I suppose. Uh, for me, I've always felt the world is inherently full of meaning, that there's uh, far more to life than uh, you know, what we can actually kind of see and touch. Um, I've always um, believed in the divine. Um, and so I feel maybe it's one of the things that we have to do here on Earth as human beings is, uh, is attempt to engage the divine as much as we can. Um, I've never really felt as if I've been sort of cut out to be a man of the cloth or anything quite like that. So for me, painting has always been a, an arena, if you like, um, an opportunity within which to attempt to engage with the divine. Yeah, you know, people often laugh at me actually, you know, for me, I don't particularly enjoy painting. It's not something that I do kind of to relax or to feel good. It's not a kind of, I'm certainly not a Sunday painter in that kind of sense. Um, for me, painting something that is, is a real a struggle for me really. Um, and every time I pick up a brush and try to seriously engage with painting and then that greater kind of idea of attempting to engage with the divine beyond that is something that I find very hard and, and actually you should be. The Stations of the Cross um, series I painted for Manchester and of course then went on to the Stations of the Resurrection for Liverpool. Um, um, at one point during the making of it I ended up um, getting um, a double infection of E. coli and you know I'm, I'm absolutely convinced that if I wasn't making the Stations at that point um, I, I don't think that would have happened. I think I would have been a little bit ill but I think the fact I got so kind of you know sort of seriously or if you like was because of the absolute spiritual and you know sort of emotional drain it had on me. Everything I do has that kind of spiritual basis to it, um, whether that's a, a landscape or a portrait or a drawing, whatever I might do.